Well, greetings, Brave Church, and happy Friday. I hope that your weekend is off to a great start. Uh, we have obviously been in very interesting days, and we have been experiencing these very interesting days for the last few months. I don't want to speak for you, but I think it's safe to say that for most of us, we've had to um, we've we've had to learn uh, how to get in a pattern really of shifting, making changes and adapting and and then just when you think that you you've got a way forward having to shift and make changes and then adapt again i know that's certainly true for myself for our family and for our brave church with that said um, a couple weeks ago we launched our reopening plan of outdoor in-person um, worship experience and today, uh, yet again, we're deciding um, to shift, make changes, and adapt. Today, I, I want to inform you that after a few days of prayer, of counsel um, from other um, church pastors that I, I see as mentors in my life, um, and evaluating where our church is at, um, we've decided that the best way forward is to suspend yet again in-person Sunday morning services and move back to an online worship experience. So here's what you can expect. You can expect that this Sunday at 10 a.m. we will have an online worship experience. Um, we're actually going to be doing a, a replay of a, a message and uh, some worship um, from a previous online experience. Um, and then you can also expect communication from myself um, as we, uh, over the next few days, are weighing how to move forward in the best way forward. For us, um, we have to look at our situation within the context of our church. Every single church is different. For us, we're a church plant. We are a young church plant. We, we don't have a, a physical um, home. Um, we rent a space. Um, and we are a church that very much so values the health and safety of our community, like I hope every single church does. And we're always trying to figure out what is the wisest use of the time that we have, the resources that we have, the energy that we have. And so over the next few days, we're going to be re-strategizing yet again, and you can expect some direction on how we as a ministry are moving forward. I also just want to say thank you. I want to thank you for your grace and your patience in this season. Um, not only do I consider myself somewhat of an amateur pastor because I've only been a lead pastor for you know a couple years now, um, this is my first pandemic. And so I know I certainly have been um, humbled as I learn and relearn um, throughout this process. And I'm thankful that I have you as someone that I can call my community, the community that I get to be a part of. Stay tuned for more information. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to us. Info at bravechurch.tv. You can email at us at e, uh, info at bravechurch.tv. Thanks again.